Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today we're going to be doing Black Friday pop hunting. Now, people were asking me, why didn't I do one yesterday? And I didn't know that Black Friday was doing all these deals on Thursday. But today we're going over to the States. We're gonna be going to Target, um, GameStop, maybe a Walmart, depending on uh, you know how's it going and if it's kind of crazy or whatever. I don't think it's gonna be crazy now. It's four in the afternoon, and it's getting dark out, by the way. Um, it's winter, I talk about this all the time. You guys always ask me why I film so late. It's not late, it just gets dark early. Uh, but anyways, guys, we're gonna see what deals we can find. I think GameStop has pops for five bucks, so that would be cool. Um, but anyways, guys, let's get started. Hey guys, so we just ran over to the post office before we started hunting, and I just wanna let you know that this uh, big package came in from Target, so you guys are gonna be seeing this unboxed on the channel soon, so I'd get ready. It's coming up this week. You guys probably know what it is, but uh, I'm gonna keep it suspenseful if you don't. Okay guys, so our first stop of the day is GameStop. Let's see what deals they've got. Okay guys, so over in the pop section, they have pops for $8 each instead of $11.99. So that's not bad, well, all $11.99 pops. Um, but they've got a bunch over here, guys. I'm noticing that they do have, oh, the Funko box. You know, it's funny, I already bought six of these. Really? Wow. Yeah. Do you want to buy six more? I kind of want to. You know what the thing is, though? I got three of the same pop. Oh, yeah. I know, I know. That's the chance, that's the risk. <sighs> it's tough. I don't know, I'll think about it. I do like these. <sighs> Thanks, I'll, I might get one. No problem, well we got a bunch of them. So. Okay, what else do we got over here? We got Max the Dog, Albus, Wreck-It Ralph, Mr. <laughs> Chimes, Sora. Uh, but like I said guys, all of these are pretty cheap now, eight bucks, so I might pick up something. I am looking for the Christmas Chewbacca, that's funny. There we go guys, the last one I need for the set. Um, but I'll keep digging around and see what else they've got. Guys, I can't forget that these Fortnite ones are also on sale. I know I always show them off, but I gotta show them off guys, because some people might be new and you've never seen them before. But anyways guys, there's the Fortnite ones. Can't forget about these guys. They've got Kingdom Hearts ones. They've got our uh, Raikou. Um, we got Mickey and Mickey and Mickey and Mickey and Raikou and Mickey and Mickey and Mickey and Mickey and and, and anyways, guys, let's keep going. Okay, guys. So over here is the line of cars coming from the mall, which the mall is like right over there. And because it's Friday and Black Friday, there is a lot of cars, and that's just a crazy amount. Normally, guys, there's nobody here. This no is get, one. this is to get onto the just like the what would you call that? Like a main, not a main road, yeah, but you know what I mean. Main. Yeah. But anyways, guys, it's still going. Like this is this is to make a right, and this is this is not good. This is crazy. crazy. Anyways, first GameStop was a success, so let's go on to the next door. Okay guys, so I know you can't see the front here, but we're at Walmart, that's all I'm trying to say here. But we are there, we're gonna go in, see what they've got for Black Friday deals, and yeah, you guys know what I mean. Let's just see what they've got. Okay guys, so we came over to the pop section over here. We've got the movie section, and it's just Ralph breaks the internet. Ooh, gosh, this was not like that this last week. Anyway, they got some plush minis down here. They've got some uh, Fix-It Felix over here, which is pretty cool. Uh, with Dumbledore, Assaultron, Osiris. Um, Vault Dweller Mail, Jake the Snake. Actually, I watched the Joe Rogan podcast with Jake the Snake the other day. It was actually pretty good. Um, but yeah, that's about it. They've got some Pez down here, which I've already picked up all of these, so I don't need to worry about that. Um, like I said, some other mysteries. And then that's about it. I guess we're going to go around, guys, see what else they've got. But for now, that's all they've got. Same as last week. Okay, guys, so our second GameStop is now there. $8 each, so let's see if we can find a cool pops, and maybe we'll get a mystery box. I, I really want to get another one. Let's go. Okay guys, so here are the pops over here guys. Like I said at the other store, they are $8.99 today. They've got some pretty good ones like Fun Bun and some from the Nutcracker. Um, one that I want to pick up today that I found is, well, it's Colossus is here, but not that I want to pick them up. I always want to get that one, I never do. Um, but anyways, the one that I want to pick up guys is Mary Poppins with Kite. Um, I was looking at this one and they have one that's, and if you guys can see it, I don't know if it's kind of hard to see, but there's a kite back there and it goes way up to above here in the box and I think that's pretty cool. Um, they also have Carmen San Diego, Nerd Rage, ah ha ha. Uh, Rose, Dobby, Ron Weasley, Nerd Rage, some other ones. Thumbnail. Okay, guys, so over here we've got a bunch of different Black Friday uh, GameStop boxes. I'm gonna be getting one of them here. I, I wanna buy more, but I've already bought six, so here's the seventh one, guys. We'll probably open it up in today's video, but uh, anyways, let's keep going. Okay, guys, so over here we've got all of the Fortnite ones again. They have like High Rise Assault Trooper, Raptor, Love Ranger, Cuddle Team Leader up in the front here. They do have some Red Nose Raiders, guys, which are pretty cool because they're only eight bucks today, so. Anyway, let's keep going. I, I am gonna pick this one up, guys. We'll open it up in today's video. Okay, guys, so I got the box. I'm gonna open it up now. I just wanted to keep the wrapping on there. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this with one hand, but I can try. Yeah, here, Mom, see if you can get it. But. Can I rip just... it? Is it okay to rip it? Oh yeah, you're good to go. If we get something good in here, guys, this is cool. I had a theory on this one, and I think I got it. Do you wanna hold the No. You don't wanna hold the camera? No. Let's see what we got here. Yes! It did! It worked. <laughs> it worked. Oh my god. Da 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 da! It worked. For real? Yeah, he got a face. <laughs> Not too shabby. 
Okay guys, our next stop is Walgreens. Let's see if they've got any new pops in. I, one, one can dream. Okay guys, so it was over here in this section and I ran into some spider hulks. So it looks like I'm gonna be picking up one of these today. <laughs> what? All right, this seems to be the best Walgreens I've ever run into and on Black Friday as well. Yeah, we're gonna have to pick this up today. I always like to show you guys just in case, but it's the same pops as last time. Spider-Man Noir with the cut top. That's about it. Um, if you guys don't know, last week we found these ones, or two weeks ago, I forget. Anyways, it's not great, but we're gonna keep going, guys. We've had a really good luck today, so I think this is gonna be it for here. So let's go over to Target. Okay, so I believe this is our last stop of the night, but we are going to Target. I'm hoping for that. What's the one? Oh, the Home Alone uh, collector's box, but let's see what they've got. Most likely not here, but we're gonna go in. Okay, guys, so we're at the back here, and I just ran into the 10-inch Demogorgon. Let's pick one up. Okay, guys, so now over in the back here, they've got some pretty good stuff in today. They've got the Spartan Cheerleaders, which is new. They've also got the Trading Places, Louis Winthorpe 3, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Now they also have Steve and Demog Demodog. I'm not gonna pick that one up today. It's kind of expensive, but cool to see it here. Um, what else do we have? MacGyver, Prince Akeem, always gonna be here. Um, I have another mystery box, but that's about it, guys. I did pick up a Demogorgon, because I will be getting this today. But uh, other than that, guys, I think that's it for this back section. So let's keep looking around. Oh, but they do, yeah, so that one's new, and then they also have Green Goblin, and this is also exclusive. I forgot Goliath here. Um, but there's got to be like a Christmas section or something. Let's go look around. Here is the other new section, guys. By the way, uh, the two MacGyvers here, let me, uh, I got one hand here. One second. Uh, so the two MacGyvers here, guys, are the exact same, in case you are wondering. Um, some of them got the stickers instead of the Goliath. So that's a fun fact there, in case you guys are wondering. They've got some medium invaders. They've got some pretty new ones, actually, now that I'm looking here. I just don't see the box, and I want that box from, uh, why can't I think of it? Home Alone, and I want that one bad. It'll be a good unboxing for you guys, but uh, yeah, that's all we've got over here. Pretty cool, some other new stuff, but we're still gonna look around. Okay guys, so now that we are back from the store, I wanna show off everything that I've got, but before we do that, I wanna promote a really cool mystery box that's out right now, and it is Fair Game Toy Store. I talked about it the other day, but I wanna talk about it again because they are stopping um, the sales on them on the 26th. So that's coming up real soon, guys. So make sure you go down to the link in the description down below um, to go check out Fair Game Toy Store's mystery boxes. They've got some really cool ones over there. I believe they're only like $16.99. They're not even that expensive. So guys, just go check them out. They're pretty cool. But um, now that we've got into this, guys, like I said, link will be top of the description. Um, but let's get into this so far. So what we got today was a lot of really cool stuff. And I think we'll go in order, I guess. Um... So let me find the first thing that I got, which I don't know where it is. Ah, yeah, it's right here. Okay, guys, so because of Black Friday, we had a lot of really cool sales, a lot of really cool stuff. Um, to be fair, only two things are really Black Friday sale-ish. Um, let's start with the first one here, which I got on sale, and it was Chewbacca with lights. Um, this was the last one I needed out of my set, so we picked it up. This was the first GameStop we went to. On the back here, guys, you can see all of the other pops that you can get out of this set. Um, I think they're pretty cool in my opinion. This is now the last one I needed for the review um, because this is going to be going for the 12 days of top pops as well. Um, so this is going to be really cool that we are doing this. Here it is here guys. Very cool um, pop to have. Chewbacca with lights is just a really nice one and I like this one a lot. I'm surprised it took me so long to get it. Um, but for $8 instead of 12 I finally caved on it and I was like, yeah, you know what, Let, let's get it. Because it, it was sale. It was on sale today for Black Friday, so it was perfect. Also guys, if you wanted to get all the Fortnite ones, today would have been a great day to do that because instead of 12 they would have been... Eight, so that's not bad. Um, but next up, we went to Walmart. Didn't get anything at Walmart. Um, Walmart kind of sucks right now because they're not really restocking. And even if they did, Black Friday kind of took it all out. I mean, I didn't get anything good from that. But then after that, we got another GameStop. We went to another GameStop and we got a Black Friday mystery box. Black Friday mystery box. Um, we bought another one. This is the seventh one we bought this year. I have already opened it up. You guys already know what's inside from earlier on in the video. So we'll just open it up and show it off a little bit closer up. Now, one thing that I want to say is when we were at the store, they have an open box that's at the back. And in that box, there was a Count Chocula Pez and I got a Booberry Pez. So I did a little swap there. Um, so in case you guys are wondering why we have a Count Chocula Pez here, this was the last one we needed for our set. Um, and they were nice enough to say, yeah, why not? Let's just switch it up real quick. Um, so really cool one. I like this one a lot. Um, and I mean, guys, it really doesn't do anything for that. It was just, you know, a quick 
and a bunch of different EB games said I could do that too. I don't know if they're going to let me if I go in with like six, but maybe with one if you want to switch up one thing here or there. I don't know. Um, but this is Count Chocula here. Pretty cool. Um, I like this one a lot. Uh, one of my favorites, actually, and that's why I wanted to get all of them. Now I have Boo Berry, Count Chocula, and Frankenberry, as well, guys, as the Yummy Mummy and Fruit Brute. Um, I'm just glad that I could get all of them. Uh, there's a little there's a little schmutz on the front here. Give me a second. There we go. That's better. Um, but now that I've got all of these, it's pretty awesome. This is the only one I have with the only a GameStop sticker on it. Um, these are eventually going to be coming out of their boxes, but because there's no candy in them, I don't know if I want to take them all out. Uh, but anyways, guys, then we also got another Tom, which is right here, guys. The ears are pretty uh, pretty bent up, but yeah, we can fix those up, no problem. There's Tom. Whoop. Um, then the other stuff we got was, of course, the pin. Um, the pin, the, um, you know, oh, not the button. Damn it, I did it again. The button, the uh, stars, and then we got this one as well, which is uh, the little button, like I said. But that's pretty cool. Now, guys, I know the last thing that we wanted to do. So, guys, if you're wondering what was going on when we were there and how we got this one um, first try here, um, no, seventh, but first try there, um, we got the Chase uh, Max from Goof Troops. This is really cool, or Goof Troop. Um, now, I want to talk to you guys how I got this one s with my little trick. So they had closed boxes up in the back, and I asked them if we could go and look at them. That's why you guys saw, like, the 15 right there in the boxes. Um, so we opened all three of them. We cut all three of them open just to see if we could find one with one box that was flipped the other way. Some of them had two boxes flipped the other way. Another one had three boxes flipped the other way. So we were a little confused. Well, really, same thing. Um, two and two. So I was like, ah, I don't know which one to get. But then when we opened the third one, there was one flip the other way. So I was like, let's try that one. So I get that one, and it happened to be the Max Chase from Goof Troops. Um, pretty cool. Uh, Goof Troop. Why do I keep saying troops? Anyways, pretty cool, guys. I'm super excited about this one. This is the most original Chase out of them, because the other ones are really just... There's no, well, there's no mold change to them. This one, he actually has a skateboard with him. So it goes from a hand up like this to a hand holding a skateboard, so... That's pretty cool. I'm super excited about getting that one. Uh, so yeah, one of my favorites that we got today. Now after that, guys, we got another... Where would we have gone next? Where would we have gone next? We would have went to Walgreens. And Walgreens, we got this, guys, here. So we got the Spider Hulk. Um, now the reason we got this one was weird. It was they, they had two of them there. And they keep putting them out every once in a while, some random ones. Was, they must just be getting in shipments slowly. But... Um, Super excited to get Spider-Hulk here. One of my favorites out of the uh, new Spider-Man stuff that they're doing. And uh, yeah, I had to have this one for the set. So there we go, guys. So that is Spider-Hulk there, guys. Super excited to have this one for the set. But let's go on to the last stuff that I got. So we went over to uh, Target, and I got a couple things. So I wanted to get some Pez for these guys, so that way I can have some Pez with them. So I decided to get this. I like collecting normal Pez as well. And I got the Christmas, um, like, you know, the stocking stuffer kind of thing. Um, and it is the Penguin Pez. And it comes with nine Pez, I believe. Three up top and then five down bottom. Um, so I'm super pumped about having this. That way I can use this Pez for these guys here. There's also the exclusive sugar cookie Pez in here, which I've had before. It's pretty good. I didn't think I was going to like it, but, yeah, it's not bad. I'm not going to lie. It's not bad. Um, but, yeah, I'm a big fan of Pez. So even just getting the Penguin Pez is super cool as well. Um, and then I also picked up the Back to the Future um, VCR t-shirt. Um, I also have the Gremlins one of this one. Those are probably the only two that I'm actually going to pick up. Um, but there's the large one with this t-shirt inside. So pretty cool that I got this one. Uh, I guess I can open it up for you guys now. I mean, I'm not going to put it on or anything. Let me use this pin here. This will help. I'm not going to lie. It's going to be helpful. Okay, so this is one of those... Um, shirts that I wanted for a while, because they, when I last time I went, it was the same Target too, they must have got more in, because they didn't have, I don't believe they had Rocky or Back to the Future, maybe I didn't look hard enough, uh, but I did get Gremlins last time we were there, so that was cool to get that one, um, but to get this one was another little added bonus, and it's only $10 for these shirts, um, it's a pretty cheap price, and it's cheaper than uh, Target's actual shirts, Target's shirts are $12.99, and then this one being 10 is not too shabby. Uh, but let's see what we got here. So this one, I believe it says 1.21 gigawatts on it. Yeah, it does. This this is a nice shirt, I'd have to say. Um, let's see what we got here. Soft shirt as well. Oh, yeah. Here we go, guys. So this is the shirt here. Boom. Um, I like this one a lot. I like how they're not pop tees and that they're just Funko shirts. Um, I think that's pretty cool there, guys, though. There's the logo on it. I like it a lot. Uh, it does have the date on an October 21st, 2015. 
Um, and then it says Back to the Future, 1.21 gigawatts, 88 miles per hour speed. If you guys don't know, that's what they need to uh, time travel with the DeLorean. So that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, guys, so we got one more thing that I think is super awesome. It was the one thing that I didn't expect to find at all today. And uh, we happened to find it. And it was this right here, guys. I want to show it off like this. We'll do it. You guys probably saw it earlier. It was right next to the counter, so I might have talked a little bit quiet when I was filming. Um, but it is right here, guys. Ready? Three, two, one. It is the 10 inch Demogorgon. Um, the 10 inch Demogorgon was, I thought, going to be super hard to find. And then all of a sudden, I get there, and they have like six or seven, something like that. Um, but here it is, here, guys. I'm not going to take it out of the box right now, but you guys will see it out of the box eventually. Um, I almost have all of the 10 inch pops. I'm missing, let's figure this out. I'm missing original Mickey's from the 90th anniversary one. I got the green and blue one. It's coming in the mail, so that'd be cool. Um, I'm missing Dino Ultra Zord, and I think that's it. I think that's everything. Yeah, that sounds about right. Dino Ultra Zord and the Mickey. Uh, I don't think there's any other ones. I got everything else pretty easy. So this one was just super cool to see. It was a nice little bonus for the day. Um, but yeah, we got a lot of really cool stuff for Black Friday, and this is more than I thought I was going to get, um, but this is a really good amount of stuff. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more from me in the future, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all that. Don't forget about the Fair Game Toy Store mystery boxes, because they're awesome, and they're going to sell out pretty quick, guys. They sell out, uh, I'm pretty sure, every time, so if you guys want to go check them out, go do it soon, because it's linked in the description. They're not even that expensive. I'm pretty sure they're like $16.99 or something like that, but... Anyways, this has been another episode of Top Pops Popsters. Thanks for watching.